Hi folks, I'm Steve Hindy for Showing Animals Respect and Kindness, or Shark. Since 1993, Shark has exposed rodeos across the U.S. and into Canada. This is a story we've never publicly told, and we want to make it part of the record of Shark and the Rodeo. In December 2007, Shark's fledgling YouTube channel was just a year old, but it had already exposed rodeo animal abuse to people around the world. The rodeo mafia saw the writing on the wall and decided to take action. Lawyers for the Professional Rodeo Cowboys Association, or the PRCA, contacted YouTube and falsely claimed that 13 shark videos infringed on PRCA copyrights. The rodeo thugs misused the Digital Millennium Copyright Act to demand our materials be immediately removed. In response, YouTube permanently disabled Shark's entire account. Service providers often comply with such requests without double-checking for legitimacy. In the case of the Professional Rodeo Cowboys Association, there was no legitimacy. Fortunately for Shark, lawyers for the Electronic Frontier Foundation sued the PRCA for misrepresentation. They noted that, among other things, the videos could not have infringed any PRCA copyright because the rodeos aren't copyrightable. The fight was on, and as so often happens when animal abusers and bullies are directly confronted, the Professional Rodeo Cowboys Association backed down. In a settlement, the PRCA paid $25,000 for the improper removals. The PRCA also agreed that any future copyright claims would first be sent to Shark's video contact and then reviewed by the PRCA's General Counsel for Legal Merit before any legal notices were sent to YouTube or any other video service. We should mention that this has not happened even a single time, which means the PRCA agrees that there was no copyright infringement. The Professional Rodeo Cowboys Association was just trying to bully us, even though their action actually broke the law. And when we fought back, they ran. Today, Shark's YouTube channel is approaching 100 million views. Rodeos have been exposed. Some have been shut down. Numerous sponsors have been lost. Shark thanks the Electronic Frontier Foundation for the vital assistance they provided. For further information about this great organization, please go to EFF.org. Unfortunately, careless or ignorant people still go to the rodeo. And unethical companies such as Coca-Cola, Macy's, and Dodge continue to sponsor these spectacles of cruelty, cowardice, and corruption. Shark will continue to expose the cruelty and the unethical companies. If you care about animals, please do not go to rodeos, and please do not spend your money with companies that sponsor rodeo animal abuse. With persistence, this cruelty is destined to ride into the sunset. You can find more information about corporate sponsors of cruelty at CorporateThugs.com. I'm Steve Hindy for Showing Animals Respect and Kindness.